It's a cave. Ken, it's a cave. like blooming mountains of the mainland. I miss so much the Philippines. The <laughs> Seriously. And the, the, the island hopping. Yeah, me too. Like and the. the To another video right. and today we're gonna be looking at the 10 best tourist spots in the province of Antique Philippines! Akusi Vanessa! Akusi Fernando and that's Malika the channel! Bakatin. We spread happiness, positive vibrations, smiles all around the globe everyone! Alright, Antique. Do you know anything about Antique in the Philippines? Where is Antique? <laughs> Antique is a province in the Philippines located in the western Visayas region. Its capital is San Jose de Buena Vista, the most populous town in Antique. The province is situated in the western section of Panay Island and borders Aklan, Capiz and Iloilo to the east, while facing the Sulu Sea to the west. Okay, okay, so we already know where Antique is located. We've never been to the Philippines for you, that is new here. Vanessa and I, we lived and traveled the Philippines for six months. Philippines is our second home and we cannot wait to go back. Yes. Seriously, we <laughs> cannot wait. We are just living in a motorhome here in Europe right now. Just waiting for the time that the border is going to be back open and we can head straight back to the Philippines yep, that's and build our what life. <laughs> Seriously, yes. we cannot wait. We are freezing time basically. Yeah, cool, that is cool. amazing. I'm super excited. <laughs> Everything that is related to beautiful spots in the Philippines, I'm up for it. Seriously, yes. I have future plans. Making yeah. future plans. So let's dive this straight into Isa Dalawa. Yeah. This video was uploaded by Lolo Kayate YouTube channel. We're gonna link the original one in the description down below. And now let's go straight into the video. Oh, wow. That looks like a little bit of Bombon. Bombon Beach, yeah. Bombon Beach in Romblom. Yeah. True. Antique. Antique, no? Yeah, antique. Stretches of white sand and pebble beach. What's beautiful, man? On the beachfront, there is a lovely 100 meter shifting sandbar surrounded wow. with clear blue waters teeming with marine life best for swimming and snorkeling. It's beautiful. The most recommended thing to do on the island is trekking atop the rolling hills. They call it Lantawan. It offers 360 degrees spectacular view of the entire island oh my including God. the beaches, nearby Nablag Islet and looming mountains of the mainland. I miss so much the Philippines. <laughs> oh, seriously. And the, the, the island hopping. Yeah, me too. Like and the, the, the island beaches. tropical life. I miss and that so much, seriously. And the free diving and <laughs> everything. Everything. I miss everything in the Philippines. Friend was emotional today. Everything. I just want to go back. <laughs> Can too. we go back? Pandemic, please let us in. Please let us in. Two. Ipisungao Falls in Cebuste, Antique. Ipisungao Falls is a series of water. When was the last time we've been to a waterfall? In the Philippines, I think. No, it's no, in the Philippines. One yeah. and a half years ago. Yeah. Almost. And, and maybe two years ago. That is insane. I miss waterfalls. I miss good vibes and good weather. Yes. Waterfalls tucked in the forested lands of Antique. Every level of cascade has its own catch basin, which is good for swimming cliff jumping and some waterfall sliding. Going atop the higher levels of the falls means crossing the river and following an unestablished trail. This is a great destination for adventure and thriller seekers, since going to cool. the falls nice. itself requires 45 minute of ascending and descending trek through the farm and forest land, oh, many so waterfalls, bamboo bridges and crossing rivers. 
The falls is truly a crown jewel of the province and a promising destination for adventure. Three, oh, beautiful. Seco Island oh, looks so like Bombo Bom Beach. They don't it. call Seco Island as Antiki's hidden paradise for nothing. Although it takes a rough three hour boat ride to get there, the island will sweep you away oh, with its striking this. sunrise. Seriously, look this white sand. It's beautiful. What are we doing here? <laughs> Can we go back now? <laughs> Oh my god, what playful is... dolphins that follow every vessel passing by. Of course, the island also is blessed with a lovely sandbar and a I love when like the ocean, you know, it's like so turquoise and then it's like mixing with like this dark green color. I think it's so beautiful. From the seaweed. Yeah, and stuff. it's so beautiful. Uh -huh. You can frolic and have some fun under the sun. For active travelers, Seco offers a load of thrilling outdoor diversions, such as beach volleyball, boating, ultimate frisbee, and trekking. Look, this island is a sandbank. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, yeah. just a sandbank. Yeah, it's amazing. It's so beautiful. Four. Wow. Nine potty coast springs in Camden. This this place reminds me of uh, the this, yeah. Samar Island in Davao. Yeah, I agree with you. Which island? I thought What's exactly the, the, island? the same. What's I the thought exactly island? the same was uh, Samar, Samar Island. Island. Samar Are you sure? Island. Guys, has been one and a half years that we left the Philippines. Yes. Samal with an L. Samal. Samal. Not Samar, City of it's Samal. Samal, okay, Samal okay. Island. Right. That, that yeah, looks reminds really me as well, yeah. Beautiful spot as well. Bustle, bustle city life. Make your want to Pandan at the northern end of Antique and revitalize your senses with a dip into Malampati Cold Springs eye-catching turquoise waters. Believe it or not, so these waters will surely wash away all your stresses and troubles. Afterwards, I go to the enchanting as well. river of Bugang and cruise along its crystal clear waters on a bamboo raft. And, by the way, did we mention that Bugang River is considered one of the cleanest bodies of water in the Philippines? Man, that's insane. <laughs> I just want a good weather, like 30 degrees. You know, like guys, we can you know, like I, but I, I feel like I feel like really bad complaining here because we have like 14 or 13 degrees a day with sun, um, comparing to like my home country where I'm from yeah, in Germany, it's like zero to minus five degrees. Well, in so Brazil, like that's insane. In Brazil, where I come from now, it's summer there and it's really hot. It's like yes. Philippines hot. I level. think yeah, we both love hot tropical weather and that's where we want to be surrounded like that's where we want to live and we want to be surrounded with like you know like tropical people like hey like warm vibes you know yeah exactly. <laughs> like summer vibes you maybe know? you would even plan to to get a motorhome in the philippines i don't know what do you guys think about that leave us a comment down below shall we get a motorhome once we go back to the philippines or not five Nogas Island in Anini, Antique. Nogas Island is one of the known tourist spots in Antique. Man, the twenty. Ah! Oh, there's Lo Lost, Lost Juan. Juan. Lost Juan. That's funny. He's really famous. Ah, we met him. We, did we a, met him, yes. Yeah. We, we catch up with him a couple of times. Covered with lush greenery. There is a funny. white sand beach on the island good for swimming. And several meters ah, off it are good spots water. for snorkeling. Since yeah. the waters abound in corals and biodiversity. On the quest to explore the island, Visitors just may nature, you know, just nature. With Kalachuchi trees, to the in. central part of the island where the towering lighthouse is standing. Atop the lighthouse is a fascinating view of the island. Several steps away from the lighthouse is the notable 100 year old creepy Balta tree. Zero. My god, all those pictures. The only thing that I can think of is when we did the, the travel with uh, Brian in, in, in Tablas. Yeah. And all around Tablas Island, and we visit so many beautiful spa uh, places. Yeah, we did uh, uh, free diving, and we. Uh, it was beautiful, yeah. I want to go back. Me too, I know. How can this I do video, that? This video is literally just. Um, it's yeah. it's not fair guys we, we've been having a lot of conversations about like when we can go back to the philippines and what we can really plan to do can we go back and now <laughs> yeah first of all i don't know if we could go back right now because i don't think that mm. the philippines accept international tourism and and second what? no yeah it's that's no my thought no i, I just think keep that's thinking yeah, of possibilities just, of yeah. us going back to the philippines but now i think there's no and other option just not yeah. other way we, i don't think we can so go no, like tomorrow know. if we can hot spring is the major jump off point hot springs to the island. hot springs hot springs Kushka. <laughs> <laughs> hot springs <laughs> remember when we've been to the hot springs in uh, negros occidental 
Either yes, way. yeah, it was really cool. Oh it was my really God. cool. It was very nice. Bug Tong Bado Falls is one of the hidden tourist spots in Antiqui, a seven tier waterfall tucked in the mountainside of the province. Out of seven <sighs> cascades, three are only accessible. That looks visitors. like, um, what's the name of the waterfall in, in uh, Close to Mao Well? Close to Mao Well. Um, unexplored. Uh, you mean, um,. Montpellier. Montpellier. <laughs> Looks like Montpellier. The first level right? is a majestic one with a wide basin good for swimming. While Not the this boulders one. on its sides serve as picnic grounds for the visitors. Going to the second level of the falls requires few minutes of trekking and climbing the steep staircase perched on the side of the cliff. The second one is a smaller falls. Exploring again the third level requires climbing an uneven Man, staircase like bedrock. Is... While wow, it's so many things to see. The third level is more majestic good for swimming and cliff jumping. The falls is at its full glory during rainy season. I really would love to go to, once we move back to the Philippines, I would love to explore some, some, yeah, unexplored places again, yeah, such as exactly. Montpelier waterfalls. And I don't think I've ever seen a vlog about that. Or once we went to, to Tablas Island, uh, I've only seen the vlog of Lost the Blanc. Uh, about yeah, exactly. that place, Tablas but apart from one that, of the it was so unexplored. Beautiful places we ever and been. I would love to explore more unexplored places in the exactly. Philippines and exactly. share that with the world. You know, like that's I think my my goal in 2021. Seven, kayak in in Tibiao Antique. Kawahat bath is the famous thing to do in the province of Antique. Although there are resorts offering this kind of experience, Kayak Inn is the most recognized one. Kayak Inn! Kawahat <laughs> bath is a relaxing experience Kayaki. originated in Antique, wherein a large kawara pot is filled with lukewarm water and added... I might have seen this! I've seen this! Becoming Filipino did a video Becoming Filipino and I think Dublin Travel as well. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, true. That's so they interesting. <laughs> looks in like the... they are boiling us. <laughs> <laughs> They're making a soup looks out of Looks like, you. yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like you're making soup of you. Water warm enough for a person to soak. Kayak Inn is situated <laughs> on an island beside the Tibiao River, with a great view of the jungle-clad mountains and fields. And they even put some seasoning and some, some salad there <laughs> to cook together. Some chicken nice. broth. <laughs> Veggie broth. Eight. Antique Rice Terraces in San Remigio, Antique. Antique Rice Terraces is do you a recently say discovered or do you say antique? of Antique. Who would have thought that in a silent valley of the province lies the most preserved approximately 200 year old rice terraces? 200 on a wow. year old that's agricultural amazing. land that's built by the Iranian Bukidnon indigenous group. A viewing area offers a breathtaking scenery of the rice terraces being irrigated by two waterfalls nearby and surrounded by the towering forest clad mountains. It is a lovely valley, but to get on site requires conquering five mountains and crossing no! rivers on a rough Oh my god! Big trekking hike! With the five mountains! Office if you want to visit this destination. Wow. Get ready for that! 9. Mount Magus, Kulasi, Antiki. Think you're a bona fide hardcore mountaineer? Why not climb one of the region's tallest mountains, Mount Maja Ass? Standing proudly at 2,113 meters. Look above how zero. many waterfalls. You One, can two, see three, from up. four. Yeah, four, four, this four waterfalls. This natural wonder will test your fortitude and physical endurance, offering the ultimate outdoor expedition in Antique. Even though the challenging climb typically takes three to four days, the mossy forest, refreshing waterfalls, and grassy slopes make it a pleasurable escape. And, at the end of the hike, you will be rewarded with an awe-inspiring vista of western Panay Island, as well as its surrounding areas. Four. Not to mention, hiking the highest mountain in Antique will give you a sense of accomplishment. Definitely. That must be amazing. Sure. It's a cave? Ten. It's a cave. Flag cave, San Remigio, Antique. For something more adrenaline pumping and sweat inducing, a trip to Igbaclag Cave is a nice addition to your San Remigio itinerary. A cluster of lime. Oh, that looks very, very similar also to that one uh, limestone climbing oh, that we Tablas? did uh, in Tablas oh, that we were that jumping we from diving. the. Yeah, cliff jumping. Oh my cliff God. jumping. Yes. Even, it was even so Brian. Scary. Even Brian, uh, our tour guide, he gave you his shoes. To, yes, because it was so painful to walk on uh, these limestones <gasps> without any oh, shoes God. because they are very, very spiky. And uh, yeah, you can definitely scratch yourself on that. So climbing, it's not the easiest, uh, but it's a lot of fun yeah, and it's, it's so, so cool, yeah. Igbeklag stands in the middle of a lush forest. 
The karst formation is more a tunnel than a cavern, and there is a path that would lead you to the top. This path is a bit challenging because of the sharp rocks. Oh, look at it this. requires a bit of upper body strength That's as you amazing. need to hoist yourself up. But once you emerge and see the canopies of the rich forest below, it will all definitely be worth it. Make sure to wear proper attire and footwear so you fully enjoy the experience. That was nice. just incredible. <laughs> I want to go to Antique. <laughs> Make, makes me want to go back to the Philippines like now. Seriously. Right now. Seriously. I mean, <laughs> makes guys, me amazing video. Let us know in the comment section down below which place you've seen in Antique or if you've ever been to Antique. Let us know. But now let's get into the fan of the day. And the fan of today, it is Jack Asso. Oh, sorry, sorry, that was the recommended of the day. You didn't mention the recommended of the day? No. <gasps> but it's gonna oh go for the. That's gonna be the fan of the day of today. <laughs> oh, Jack Asso, I'm so sorry. He recommended Fernando the video. Fernando forgot you. No, I didn't. It's still in the video. He recommended the video. Jack Asso, he said. If you're having chance to visit again the Philippines, I recommend you to explore Antique. I'm from Iloilo, but I love Antique. Can you react to this video? And it's exactly this video that we oh, react to. Thank you thank so you much. So for much. Me you are the fan of the day. We appreciate that. Sorry for my mistake. <laughs> it's my bad. Guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you want to recommend the next the video, video. <laughs> the only thing you gotta do is subscribe right now. Leave a comment down below or follow us on the socials, Facebook and Instagram. And don't forget to give us a happiness thumbs up. crossing. Yes. And, and see give you us guys a thumbs up. Bye. We'll see you in the next one. Everybody, Mwah. cause lately all it ever does is change. Feels like we're only talking, talking, going round and around, back around. I will fight like no other every day.